Hi, everyone, welcome back to my channel. In this video I am going to share with you. Top 10 Brilliant Tips to Spruce Up Your Garden It takes not only time but energy to make a garden look its best, but it's worth it when you see your garden lush and blooming. Here are 10 practical tips to turn you into a green thumb. Get ready to be brightened up. 1. Upcycle Toilet Paper Rolls If you have stocked up on toilet paper recently, then you have plenty of ready-made seed starters for your garden. Find a waterproof container, and align empty paper rolls in it. Then fill each roll with potting soil, and plant your seeds inside. When it's time, you can plant them directly into the ground. Even better, the rolls will decompose over time while your seeds sprout safely. 2. Build up teacup gardens. Do you have vintage teacups collecting dust in your pantry, so why not take them out for a better use? They can be the perfect containers for teacup succulent gardens. Besides the cup, find small pebbles, potting soil and a succulent. Then place a few pebbles in the bottom, and fill it with potting soil. Finally add your succulent and you can enjoy all the fun that this tiny plant brings. 3. Fork off. Uninvited guests. To deter uninvited guests from entering your space, you can turn to plastic forks for help. Just stick it evenly near your plants with the pointy end up, you can get rid of them for good. 4. Sprinkle soap shreds around. To deter hungry rabbits from ruining your plants, grate some soap with your food processor and sprinkle it among your garden beds. The smell of the soap will repel them while doing no harm to your plants. Remember to replenish the shavings after heavy rain. 5. Space seeds evenly. In light of aesthetic layout and growing space of plants, you need to space seeds evenly. However, it's not easy without a specified tool, but your muffin tin can be a real lifesaver. Just press the bottom of it into your freshly tilled dirt and move forward to repeat the process. 6. Plant your soda cans. Set aside some old soda cans in case you don't have a proper planter. To use a deep one, you need to fill its bottom with these cans before planting your shrub. In this way, you can save a lot of soil as well as leaving air pockets for your greenery. 7. Protect plants from frost. Seasoned gardeners will take precautions to avoid the damage resulting from a sudden frost. Instead of blanketing all your plants with a plastic layer, you can cover individual plants with cloches. Simply cut the bottom of a milk jug and place it over your fragile seedlings. Trust me, they will survive. 8. Filter water not soil. It's a real headache for gardeners to water their potted plants, because soil always flows out with the excess water. Don't worry, as a simple coffee filter can help you out. Make sure to place it at the bottom of your pot before you fill it with soil so that water can drain easily while retaining the nutritious soil. 9. Easy Fertilizer Recipe It may surprise you that Epsom salt can be used as an incredibly effective fertilizer for your greenery, because it contains magnesium that helps seeds sprout and absorb vital nutrients. Just mix 2 teaspoons of Epsom salt with 1 gallon of water per month. Then pour it onto the base of your plants and watch them grow. 10. Homemade Weed Killer In order to make your garden lush with greenery rather than weeds, you use weed killers. However, those harsh chemicals can damage your plants and the cost can be high over time. So why not make some natural weed killer? Simply fill a spray bottle with the mixture of vinegar, salt and a little dish soap, and you can see how the magic works. Thanks for watching. Have a good day.